Welcome to A State of Sight. I'm Isaac Porter and this is your update in ophthalmology and eye care. Today is 10-11-12, October 11th, and it's a very special day because today is World Sight Day, which is a joint initiative put on between the World Health Organization and the International Agency for the Prevention of Blindness, along with other organizations, in order to promote awareness and help improve vision across the world. I'll put the link so you can see more details about World Sight Day, but one of the major emphasis that they're bringing is that across the world there are 285 million people that are visually impaired. Of these, 39 million are blind and then 246 million have low vision, which means they could have either severe or moderately impaired vision that can cause significant trouble in their everyday life. Out of all of these 285 million people who are visually impaired, the thing is that 80% of this is preventable. And that's one of the key missions of World Sight Day in raising awareness and trying to help prevent some of these preventable causes of visual impairment. This is a difficult task because over 90% of the people with visual impairment are located in developing countries where eye care or even glasses may be difficult to obtain. Of all of these people, the number one cause of the visual impairment is uncorrected refractive error, which basically means people that are either nearsighted or farsighted and need glasses or contact lenses in order to see more clearly do not have access to this and therefore their vision uncorrected is very poor. Of the other causes of blindness, uh, many of these could be medical problems and the number one cause of blindness medically is cataracts. As you know, probably a cataract is when the lens inside the eye starts to become cloudy and the treatment is removing the cloudy lens to replace with a clear artificial lens implant. Unfortunately, this is not available in many parts of the world because it takes a little bit of advanced surgical techniques in order to remove the lens from someone's eye and replace with an artificial lens. But the good thing is, many people are working to provide this in other countries where it's not very available and they have overcome many hurdles in making the procedure more efficient, uh, requiring less technology for the procedure, and even getting lens implants made locally that can be much more affordable for the people. Glaucoma is another preventable cause of blindness that is common across the world, and that's usually due to high pressure in the eye that damages the vision and damages the nerve in the back of the eye. Uh, other causes of blindness include macular degeneration and clouding of the cornea or the clear shield that covers the front of the eye and also diabetes when it's uncontrolled can cause severe trouble with the vision. I want to wish everyone a very happy World Sight Day and uh, please check out the links for more information. If you have any comments or questions please post. We'll be happy to interact with you and we hope to see you again soon next time on State of Sight.